Hey guys, we're back with more Mean Girls Senior Year. What will happen in today's episode? In today's episode, 10 years of loading screens. I just can't handle it. Oh my god, I waited like 10 years hoping I'd get more gems, but I didn't. Why did I not get more gems? I seriously... Whatever, I need to figure out how to... You guys told me if I wait, I'll get gems. But I didn't. Whatever, we can't right now. Tempting offer, but I've already got a mountain of homework. On the first day of school, that's rough. Later, awkward. Peace, bitch. Today, I'm talking with Micah Bergman, who's wearing... Not happening. Between the party and that class, it's going to be impossible to avoid a... a Regina. Regina. Sorry, I don't know how to speak. Awkward, hey, wait up. Please, no. Weird, I feel like I knew someone with that name. Please don't remember, please don't remember. Whatever, I know a lot of people. So I just got caught up at... At Carrot, uns Carrot Uncensored. Carrot Uncensored, that sounds like a great Twitter. Carrots Uncensored. It's just like carrots that look like dicks. Dick pics of carrots that look like dicks. Yeah, anyway, sorry, I got really distracted there for a second. Uh-oh. Is it true you're running for president? I was planning to at my last school, and then this morning, Principal... <sighs> and then this morning, Principal Duvall suggests I go for it. Oh my god, it's like you want to be just like me. Dude, I just got to this school. I don't even know you. No, I... Oh wait, do we know each other? It's like you want to be my twin and do everything I do. Should I text you and tell you what I'm going to wear tomorrow? No, it's not like that. Mr. Vall told me... Oh my god, calm down. I'm only joking. Don't take things so seriously. Sorry. And stop apologizing. Sorry, I just... It's, going to Yale really means a lot to me. Yale means a lot to me, too. Three million dollars, to be precise. Anyway, I just wanted to say I know it's like we're competing... Dude. Dude. You know what I would do? I'd be like, yo. For a hot million... You can have Yale. You can have it. I'll go somewhere else. Just give me that hot one million dollars. I think she'd... Don't you think she'd make that deal? I feel like she would make the deal. Because then she gets two million, but then what if I win? She gets nothing if she doesn't go to Yale. Oh, I would put that... I'd put that forward because then we get paid. And like, we can just pick some other great school. You know how it is. Anyway, I just want to say I know it's like we're competing in some weird way for the Yale spot. Yeah. But I don't want it to feel weird between us. Me neither. Thanks, but I really... <laughs> My voice... Wow! <laughs> Thanks, wow, I really appreciate you saying that. Good. Oh, and I hate to tell you about the Micah thing. It's just super sketchy that he'd lead you on like that when I'm pretty sure he has a girlfriend. Sorry to be buzzkill. I'm just looking out for you. Thank her, ask about the girlfriend. Who is she? She goes to another school. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, you really like him. I can tell. I don't even know him. I mean, he's kind of a total weirdo and has like zero friends, but if that's what you're into, don't let me stop you. Okay. I'm really glad we had this little talk. I didn't want you to take anything personally. You know what? Let's make this friendship official. We need a picture. Uh, okay. Welcome, Aqua. We're gonna have such fun together. Oh my god. Share to Instagram. No, I'm not sharing this. Cool, we looked hot. See you tomorrow. Ugh, don't blow your fucking kiss at me. Get your bad breath all over me. Alright, back home. Hey, Mom. Mom. There she is! There she is! How was your first day, baby? Bottle it up, let it loose. Bottle it up. It was pretty standard. Awkward, I know when something is bothering you. Spill. Okay. The principal said only one student per year gets into Yale. What? How can they do that? Some sort of co quota. My whole vision is crumbling. Okay, listen. Deep breaths here. There's not another high school senior out there who's got a better shot than you do. To even have a shot, I have to win student body president. I need to convince a thousand strangers to vote for me by month or Thursday. Monday? Monday? Did it even remotely look like Monday? And I just am like, Thursday, oh, that must be Monday. 
sorry. If it were any other girl, that would intimidate me. But you're my daughter. I taught you to aim high and work hard. And that's exactly what we're going to do here, right? But mom, <laughs> the girl I'm running against. Mom, it's Regina. That Regina, we must know her. Yeah, she's acting like she doesn't even remember me. Okay, baby, I know how much you want Yale. And you know how much I want Yale for you. More than anything. Maybe Regina put the past behind her. Maybe it's best if you do too. But mom, if anyone finds out what happened... Ugh. I have got to avoid Regina at that party tomorrow. Shit's happening, you guys. Oh no, not the loading screen. Let it be a quick one, please. Please, let it be quick. Season 3. I have one of my tickets. I'm gonna spend it. I'm gonna spend it. Your dream hangs in the balance at Glen Coco's party. Tuesday. <laughs> Sorry. I just clicked and... Two days until the election. What should I wear for my second day? Maybe something comfortable, bold, out there. Ooh, let's go bold. Oh no, I don't want to wear that anymore. Maybe not. Out there, what's that? Oh no, I don't want to wear that. No. Comfortable. Oh god, yeah, I guess that's... I'll go with that one. For now. For now. Hey everyone, welcome to Act Hair and Uncensored. It's two days before the election, you know what that means. Candidates Regina George, Chang Pak, and what's her name will be competing for your votes. And more people are talking about the new girl. Regina's fallen to 902 projected votes. Trang is at 202 and the new girl's up to 37. Now back to our regular scheduled programming. We're here with honorary cool Asian Gretchen Wieners. <laughs> Ciao. So Gretchen has some steamy news about her love life. Well, you may recall that back in June, things with Jason ended in a fireball of heartbreak. So sad. But then I hooked up with Dane at Glen Coco's 4th of July party and he could not be more perfect. Basically, we're engaged to be engaged. Ah, oh, so romantic. Hi, Karen. Hi, um, she forgot me already. Remind her who you are. It's awkward, we met yesterday. You talked about my outfit? What is she? Shush, she's conjuring the past. Like using her memory. I know, wow, right? She has such a gift. <laughs> oh, sure, huge talent. She could really change lives. I see a guy in overalls. That wasn't me. I'm awkward K-pop, resident new girl. Gretchen Wiener, soon to be Gretchen Tucker. Hasn't Dane Tucker, my boyfriend slash future fiance. What up, females? Uh, so awkward. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh God, all right. So awkward, see any boys you think are cute? Mentioned Micah. There's this guy, Mike, in my Shakespeare, Shaky Spears class. Is he the one who talks about anime all the time? Oh, that guy who wore a fedora all of sophomore year. Don't worry, I'm sure it was just a phase. They can't all be as perfect as Dane. Isn't Dane incredible? Ooh, you're so lucky. I tell him that all the time. Anyway, I don't know a lot of people yet, so I'm trying to get the word out. I'm running for student body president, and I would love to earn your votes. You're the one running against Regina? Oh no, you cannot do that. Why? Why not? You just can, okay? And just so everyone it's clear, I'm voting Regina. Karen? I'm not old enough to vote, but my 18th birthday's in three weeks. Can I vote for you then? Karen! <laughs> Thank you for your time. Why would I go up to Regina's best friends and ask them to vote for me? It seems like, you know, it seemed like that wasn't going to go well for us. That was brutal. That was hilarious. <laughs> Come on, you two. She's new. Awkward. Didn't, 
Did that look as humiliating as it felt? Absolutely. Don't worry, it will be seen by Karen's 80,000 followers. How do you know how many followers she has? I subscribe. What? Her makeup tutorials are really instructional. And your mom is cool with you plundering her eyeshadows? Of course not. I used yours. I thought you were going to come out to her. I want to, but that's just the thought is terrifying. Almost as terrifying as running against Regina. I feel confident. I know she's really fun. I don't feel confident at all. I don't even know why I selected that. But if I can get people to hear me out, I think I have a good shot at winning. It's just gotta stay. We're staying positive. That's why I chose it. Brave. Possibly insane. It's not impossible. Every once in a while, the gazelle outruns the lion. Pardon her analogy. She grew up in Africa. That's so cool. Evanston must be so boring to you. What was that like? What was that like? It was pretty wild. Old pun master Huron over here. All right, guys. I got to get to a mathletes meeting. I'm trusting awkward to care there. I'm trusting awkward to your care. So please don't corrupt her. Hey, we were only responsible like 12% of your downward spiral last year. Am I completely crazy to be doing this? Not at all. There are two things I love in this life. My family and the hot guy who works at Smoothie Shack. Student government. I intend to turn Smoothie Guy into family. Awkward. If Regina wins student body president, do you know what happens? My dream is destroyed. Where? Where? Student government, as we know it, is destroyed. You're going to Glen Coco's party tonight, right? But won't Regina be there too? fashionably late so get there early oh so, so get there early and sniper constitutes before she shows up what are you going to do where are you gonna wear awkward oh what did you just say to me oh if you want to get votes you got to wear something eye-catching something bright and amazing that'll get people's attention damien's right no pressure but the entire social ecosystem's delicate balance rests on you winning oh shit is there i might have there might there was probably a bell ringing sound i can't hear it right now so sorry you guys get my bell rings again which again are excellent janice and i will pick you up around eight kevin's taking me of course he is that i will pick you up around eight while janice and kevin play pocket billiards in his dad's hybrid see you at eight. Oh my god we're gonna do this party we're going i may be in over my head Come on, you're going to have a great time. Damien said he'll give me a ride, too. So I'll see you in a little bit. You're really going to that thing? Yeah, I think it's going to be lame, awesome, awesome. You have really low standards for what constitutes awesome. Look, I'm the new bitch. I'm just trying to get to know people. I don't need your fucking attitude right now. Ouch. Have fun, I guess. I intend to. God, ugh, he's such a snob. I know it's a house party, but I also have to look like someone you'd vote for. Alright, eye-catching. 60% off! Oh, uh, no. I don't know about this. I feel like my hair fucks it up. Uh, not this time. Hold on. I feel like I need to choose that one, though. I like that. What's polish? No. Too uptight. Alright, we'll go eye-catching. It's 60% off. Let me not choose this one because I don't have the diamonds because I didn't even read how much it was I just guessed I could do it because it let me this is the one I'd vote for this your outfits are stored in your closet if you buy it a lot of them good where are you off to looking so cute thanks mom I hate lying but it's really hit or miss if she'd let me go to a party should we tell the truth? I'm what the mom would understand, right? New girl needs to go to a party. Meet, it's a party. On a school night? Mom! I know, but it's super important for me to go for my campaign. It's the only chance I'll have to meet the people who are voting, Mom. Don't even start this bullshit. You also have a camo t camel toe, and it's like seriously distracting. Okay, just don't drink anything blue. Uh, I won't buy. Please let me out. I cannot stand you right now. And promise me you'll be home by 11. Mom, please, I promise. Huh? There's my ride. Good luck with your camel toe, Mom. Please fix by the time I get home. Or be sleeping. Because seriously, just stop. You're embarrassing me. You're embarrassing me. There's not even anyone. Stop. All right, we're home. And we're not home. We're at the party. <gasps> oh my god, it looks like Katie has like a, a mega camel toe now too. I can't unsee any of this. Feast your newcomer eyes on this. 
Wow, Glenn has really outdone himself this time. What happened to that guy's pants? Glenn Coco's party happened to that guy's pants. Oh my calteen bars, Alex Andrews is here. <laughs> Who's Alex Andrews? Only, only the hottest guy to ever go to North Shore. He was student body president the year before I got here, and even I know who he is. He really killed it with that campaign. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Awkward, you should totally talk to him. He's almost never around, and he would know exactly how to campaign at this party. He'll get you a huge number of votes. Oh, too bad. Don't talk to him. I can't do that. Suit yourself. I'll get some. I'll get the jewels by next episode. I'm sorry. I should have done that before this episode. But I thought, like, with time going by, I would have gotten more, and I just didn't. Yo, everybody! Dan's about to do human slings hide into the hedges! Alright. Just like we discussed in the car, target the clicks to gain as much ground as possible. You ready to do this? I was born ready. That's not true. Dude, uh... Don't kill my self-esteem before I do this. Go get him, Tigress. Damien wasn't kidding. This place is click central. I'll start with the BAM geeks, burnouts, nerdy Asians, preps. Hmm. Hmm. Let's start with the preps, I suppose. Ten minutes later. We discriminate against all the time. I hear ya. Everyone treats you different the minute you show up wearing... Argyle. Right? It's not like I have a superiority complex. I'm just better than everyone. And don't get me started on North Shore's policy of athletic exclusion. I've been trying to get a croquet team off the ground for years. You know, I'm actually running for student body president and... Awkward, come over here. Damn it, Damien. I was just making progress. Hurry, they just walked in. Who's they? The mouthpiece of the most influential click at North Shore. The Jackson cheerleaders. Godspeed. All right, I got this. I got this. Hey, Dane. Love the human slingshot. That was epic. Psst, it was a basket toss. Oh, you're the one who decided to run against Regina. Talk yourself up. Why not? I have three years of student government experience under my belt. And as far as I know, Regina doesn't have any. And you're hot. Thanks, I know. Not as hot as Regina, though. Okay, no, I'm, like, way hotter. Fuck you. That the mathletes got $2,000 for some stupid computer and the athletic program got screwed? We're the ones with fans. We deserve that money. With 2000 we could take a charred bus to the way games. Shift mathletes' money to the athletics program. I support that. I can support that. I have to think, can I like think about it? I can't support that. If there's not enough money in your budget, I'd look at that as an isolated issue. But I can't take money away from another extracurricular to fix the problem. Hmm, this kind of changes things. Hopefully I impressed them enough. Probably not. No, I can't give you that money. If you need to make curfew, you might want to speed this up. Yeah, girl, get out there. Oh my God, is that smoothie guy? Hashtag destiny. You've got this awkward. Uh, no, I don't. Ten minutes later. Ten minutes. <laughs> Damn, I was like, is this really going to be ten minutes? I'm awkward. I'm awkward. <laughs> I'm awkward. I'm awkward. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're aware. Oh, God. That's just the last... All of that just made me feel so much worse and it we're never gonna win the student body president. <laughs> Whoops, sorry guys. <laughs>